What up, y'all? DC Fango Guy. Freshly out of the shower. I do have a package. I did order something off Hatch Gear last week. Um, I ordered it on Tuesday. So they really uh, they processed and they shipped in a great amount of time. That always makes me happy. Let's go ahead and crack this open. Ha! <laughs> I'm loving this already. Okay. New hat. That's fucking sweet. I'm not, I've never had a flat bill hat, so I decided to give it a shot. But they, they added a bunch of Riddle Box merchandise, you know, promoting the new tour. So I decided to go ahead and uh, pick some stuff up. So new hat. I'll go ahead and slide that on. Oh, wow, that is snug for now. I'm going to stretch that bitch out. We'll just go ahead and get rid of the packing list. That has to come out last. So, new hat. New shirt. Great Malenko. You know, I'm trying to get all the Joker card shirts, so. But I'm trying to get them in 5X. I can wear 3X, but after one wash, the shit gets tight as fuck. And I just don't like it. So, let's go ahead and show the back of that. Boom. I love it. I love the Great Malenko. So, new hat. New shirt, new CD. I did pick up the Sick Kids Maxi single. Now, I'm going to be doing an, uh, a review for it, but I decided to go ahead and unbox this because, you know, I haven't done an unboxing in a while. I haven't really done a whole lot of videos here lately. So for the sake of doing a video, I went ahead and unboxed this. And also to say, because a lot of people are probably like, wait a minute, motherfucker, you just ordered something on Hatchet Gear. Now, you've already made a couple videos talking about how you would love to go to the Riddle Box show, but you can't because you got to save money for the gathering. And yet, you are on here with a package off Hatch Gear that you just ordered. So, what the fuck? And that's kind of the other point of this video. I also wanted to talk for a minute. I don't know if people are watching the every Saturday afternoon hangout vlog video, video casts that we're doing over on Carnival Spirits. Every Saturday afternoon, we try to do a hangout now. And the last one we just did, I brought it up that I came to uh, I came to grips with the fact that I will not be going to the Rental Box show. And the reason behind that is after watching the Fago Lovers interview with Violent J, and they asked about all the venues being small, Violent J said that they're just keeping it real small, kind of low budget. There's not going to be anything spectacular to the show. There's going to be a banner for the... I mean, I mean he didn't say nothing spectacular, but he said there's going to be a banner with the riddle box behind them and then they're going to perform the riddle box in its entirety and hearing that um, you know as much as I would love to go see the riddle box show as much as I would love to go to a small venue a small show if it's small I mean most of the venues are probably going to end up sold out who knows but I would love to go to that because use the smaller shows it, it can be more intimate because there's less people there but for me it's kind of like I'm looking at the Riddle Box show, and they're saying it's going to be small, and then I'm looking at the gathering, and it's supposed to be big. So for me, it's kind of like I'm looking at the smaller picture versus the bigger picture, and the gathering is the one I want to go to as much as I would love to go to Riddle Box. I have come with the grips that I don't want to go to the Riddle Box. I want to go to the gathering. And this package was actually just kind of a, a taste of getting me ready because I'm getting excited for the gathering and they started a new program at work where we actually do get bonuses now and I did get a bonus in April so that was when I decided to go ahead and order this to treat myself because I'm busting myself at work I'm stressing at work I'm excited for the gathering so I went ahead and treated myself so there you guys go that is what I got you got the riddle box cap that is fucking awesome you got the great Malenko shirt that's fucking awesome. And you got the Sick Kids single, which I will be dropping a review on within a couple days. I was going to go ahead and do it when I got this, but I went a couple days ago to actually watch the interviews that are on this. But Punk Rock Juggalo was the only person I found that had this entire maxi single uploaded on YouTube. And he has removed all his videos, so now I'm going to actually go and listen to this before I drop a full review on it. So be on the lookout for that, and thank you guys for watching.